Hey everybody, how are you? It's Carrie from Carrie T Says. Today, lounging around. Um, <clears throat> not really. I'm in my t-shirt and shorts because I was going through things for the real real. I have a second appointment with her, Carrie, on Monday to go through some items. I'll show you how much stuff is going on. I also wanted to cross post or cr just make sure everything was on her list that was in the bags and I had to put tags on the bags for them. So that took me a few hours to make sure everything was in there. Hair all over, hair a mess, hair in a bun, no makeup, t-shirt, one of my favorite bands if you wanted to know, shorts. And I got two thread up boxes today. So I'm gonna do one for each video. I'm gonna get right into it because I'm exhausted. I'm hungry, I wanna hang with my family. It's beautiful out. <clears throat> and I'm gonna try and see if I'm up for taking the dogs for a walk. Before I get into that, I want to thank you guys for all the support for my video today in <clears throat> regards to me having ankylosing spondylitis and anyone else living with a silent disease, autoimmune disease, or otherwise, even depression, anything of the sort. I hear you. I think of you. I'm with you. We're in this together. Yes, we will overcome and make our lives the best we can together. So let me get right into it. Da -da -da. A box. I open the top because I hate punching, as you know. Um, designer rescue box, DIY rescue box, seven pieces, ninety dollars. Okay. <clears throat> um, let's see. First, we have. I'm so hesitant to get these Christian Louboutins. Oh boy because the last time I got one fake one and one real one, and it's really hard to tell the difference. The back's not being, these are pretty beat up. These are beat up, look at the front, oof. And yeah, mm, not sure they have like some thread showing. Someone had some heel guards. They smell a little like foot odor. These need to be cleaned for sure. Let me show you the bottom. See the red has a little like blue undertone. Um, I mean the Louboutin's in the right place. I just don't know because like there's like glue coming off. Like that's the only thing. I don't know. I have to look at these closely. Usually Paris is down a little lower. The footbeds don't usually have a cushion in it, believe it or not. They don't have a cushion in it. So I'm gonna have to look at these more closely. I'm not sure if they're real or not because, again, like why is there threads? I mean, that could just be from use maybe. I don't know, I have to look closer. So let's see, we got some clues. We have a Diane von Furstenberg 100% silk. Okay, there's a dress. It's a, oh, it's a halter dress. It's a halter wrap dress and it's navy blue. I always wanted to get, a, oh no, it's not. It's just a silk dress, a wrap dress from her. It's hard when it's not on a hanger. I know it's a wrap dress because it has that. I always wanted to get like her regular casual long sleeve wrap dress and I know a lot of people have gotten them, but I haven't, and I really want to get one. Let me just tie this to see you. Okay. Sheer silk dress, and it's lined. It's a midi dress. It flares out. I'm sure when you spin, it will be flowy, and it is it's fully lined. Um, and this so far looks to be in pretty good condition. I actually have a shirt from her with velvet that has like the same kind of front. It looks the same. Okay. So we have that. We got Diane von Furstenberg silk wrap dress. Next we have, this looks like Burberry print. We have a dress, yeah, from Burberry size six. Burberry London. Oh, it 
The tag looks a little weird. Hmm. Okay. Well, Burberry, like fit and flare, summer dress. It's fully lined. Here's the lining. It feels like cotton or has a little linen blend to it. So hold on, let me see if I could find, no, there's no tag. So just Burberry summer, summer dress. And it has a tie at the waist that's coming off. So this is cute. At a glance here, I don't see anything wrong with it. Size six, if anyone's interested, and it's black and white. It's really pretty, actually. Tory birch. Um, feels like nylon. I don't want to get a white um, bag. I just want to see, it has dirt all over it. I just want to see if the dirt will come off. Because it is nylon, which is one good thing about nylon is usually the dirt comes off. Just using a plain old baby wipe. It looks like it came off, but the only other issue is, and I could fix it a little by just taking that off and filling it in. Um, or maybe just take it off and leave it white. I'm not gluing it back down because it wouldn't work. There's pieces missing. Uh, Tory Birch satchel. It's just a little lint, nothing major. So the inside looks good. And it's so funny because in fact it doesn't, it still has the plastic over the pole tab. That's so bizarre. Hmm. So we can work on that if we take the, uh, the rubber off. It's, it's all right, it's okay. It's not my favorite, but it's okay. I wanna put it to the side so I can work on that. Okay. Next. I have a wallet, a zip up wallet. Has some wear, very bright orange. <laughs> Kind of matches that. I think it's the bright orange theme. Oh, okay. Very bright. It's the primary colors. It feels like it's a box of Crayola crayons, but it's actually from a good brand. It's from Come de Gar Garçons. Garçons. Um, definitely has some wear and some dirt. I can clean it up a little bit, clean the dirt and trim that. It's a great brand, but they're usually known for like their shirts. Sometimes they're stripes, but they have like a heart with like some eyeballs in it. Yeah. Oh, I know what this is because I sold one similar to this, but it was fabric. This is like a Gucci bag. It's the Jackie O bag. They don't go for much. It's like the bottom of the line, but since it's all leather, it might go for a little bit more. My other one, I think I got 125 for. So you can see Gucci right on the label. And then you just press it like that and it opens and it's all black leather one. Black is good, has a little scratch, has a little wear. So I can clean this up a little bit. These are known sometimes to get cracks here and this one doesn't have cracks, so I'm happy about that. So, Victoria Burge Gucci um, bag and then um, the a wallet, Christian Louboutin shoes that are, mm -mm. And one, I, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, and the seventh item, of course it is. It's a long chomp bag in horrible condition. <laughs> um, someone said you can send these in to long chomp to get fixed. It even has like a cigarette burn in it. I think I never got this style. At least it doesn't smell like smoke. But 
There's the tag that's like worn off. This one has seen better days. Someone had loved this for sure. Long chomp, long chomp. And this one does not fold up, does it? Oh, it said folds up. Carry. Yeah, it's like a slate gray. So I'm going to see if I can send this in. This is like the fourth one I have that I want to... I'm making a box to see if I can send in if that really works. So that was my whole box. What did you guys think? Not sure if they're real garbage. Two dresses, purses. Uh, I don't know. It's okay. It's okay. I'm not mad at it. I'm not blown away. I'm not mad at it. It's okay. Would I have gotten that again? Maybe, but after the $300 ones, I don't know if I was very excited for it. So maybe it's just my mood towards it. I don't know. Let me know what you like the best below. If there's anything you like, do you think it was worth it again? Let me know. Do you think these are real? I actually have a video coming up. I'm going to do the real versus fake ones that I got to show you. So anyway, I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you have a fantastic weekend. And until next time, be you. Ciao.